What is your dog's name? Caligula. That is a long name. What do you call him for short? Faggot. That's offensive. That isn't a very nice nickname. It is much less offensive than the nickname I gave my girlfriend. What nickname did you give your girlfriend? Cunt. That is more offensive than faggot for sure. Would it make any difference if I told you I spell it with a K? No. I think you are a vile and depraved, pathetic excuse for a human being. Why don't you crawl back up your mother's leg and get aborted? Would you feel sorry for me if I told you that I don't have a girlfriend? Yes. Why don't you have a girlfriend? Probably because very few slutty gals actually like being called cunt. I'm only attracted to slutty girls. Do you have any slutty girlfriends? No. Really? I'm not picky. The answer is still no. I promise to leave my dog in the other room while you're slutty friend and I do the nasty. I swear I have never given a dog a bone, yet. No. Come on, I want to get it on like Donkey Kong. No. What are you doing later? I am washing my hair. That can wait. I am washing my hair. I'm standing next to you. I can tell that you smell good, your hair already smells good. Please consider it. I don't want to have to use my connections at Homeland Security to hunt you down. The answer is still no. Would you like to pet my dog? Yes. Would you like to sit on my face? No. Can I smell your pussy? No. Well then, it must be your feet that I smell. I didn't say may I. I have to leave. I hope to see you again. Goodbye. I have a feeling I will be seeing you again very soon. Much sooner than you could ever imagine. I am going to the police. The police are idiots. They are too busy enforcing all of the stupid laws. They don't give a shit about the stalker from the dog park. I guess you're right. I should probably go on a date with you. Really? No. You are pathetic. I have vomited six times while we were having this conversation and I have had to swallow the vomit each time for fear of being impolite. Oh well. I guess I have my answer. I'm going to cry into my hat now. You are not wearing a hat. I know, that makes it a much creepier thing to say, doesn't it? Not as creepy as your dog's name. I won't tell you what I named my penis. Oh god. Please don't. I don't have any more time to talk to you anyway. I have to go make soap carvings of half-nude women and photograph them. Goodbye. Can I get your number? Yes. I want to give you false hope. Also can you give me your number as well, so I can put it in my phone as do not answer? So I guess sex with me is out of the question for now? You will learn to love me. I hope you do, I wouldn't want to have to keep you tied up in my closet as a sex slave. Goodbye. It was nice talking to you.